Hey guys, it's Holtz Play 736 here today. We're going to be doing a quick car review. Today we're going to be doing the Porsche Carrera GT. A 4 out of 10 in the HW Exotic series and it's from the 2016 E case. So pause if you want the QR code and the code is 7I8O as in the letter O and J. Most other cars it doesn't say much on the back so now I think we should crack it. Let's do this. So I really like the matte black colour and it would look very good. Let's put this on the turntable. I just realised this is a very beautiful model with the matte black. So it's got some yellow rims on it. It's got a yellow and black stripe with the Porsche tampo on the front and it also has some headlight tampos. Also has tail light tampos with the Carrera GT logo but a bit annoyingly it has the Hot Wheels logo there. So here's the side of the car, here's the front, you probably just saw it before, and here's the other side. What, can you guys tell me what these are in the description below? They look like little turbine or pipe things on the back of the car. So because I think they're focusing on a black and yellow theme, and it's got a weird yellow interior which looks very weird. I think it would look a bit better if it was sort of a cream colour. But then again, that wouldn't look very good if that part in there was cream. This has got a metal body and a plastic base. And here is the base. The base code is H47 for the 47 week of 2015. Just says Porsche Carrera GT. And this was first introduced in 2006. Let's go test this out on the track. We're gonna be doing a bit of downhill racing. So in lane three, we've got the Porsche RS GT3. Lane two, we've got the Nissan 370Z. And in lane one, obviously, we've got the Porsche Carrera GT. Set, go. Went a little like this. First, second, third. Now to really test the speed of the Carrera GT, we're gonna race it against one of my fastest downhill races, the Bentley Continental Super Sports. Ready, set, go. So as you can see, it's not the best downhill racer, but it still gives it a fair shot. Anyway, I'd give this car an 8 out of 10 just because I love that matte black look. And once again in the comments, can you let me know what these turbine things are in the back? I'm not sure if what they are, but tell me if you know. Anyway, check out my channel for more content like this. Like and subscribe. Bye for now.